Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, currency traders and investors worldwide. It's your boy L Camp, and we're back for another Euro session review. I am exponentialgrowth.com, and welcome. So let's get it right to it. Checking out some of our trades today from the Euro session. Just gonna get right to the action here. I had some um, bias that the euro was going to continue to the downside. The euro dollar here was going to continue to the downside. So um, I took a short position. So I took a short position uh, on the euro here at a 1740, which is this green line here. And uh, expectation that price would just... Uh, continue to pass on down and I'm looking to collect that uh, premium uh, at 38 at 39.50 uh, for a risk of $15 and a reward of $30 um, still kind of new when uh, testing this out um, just getting real solid with my plan at this point and uh, I was off with, a, with the numbers a little bit um, actually see how this played out place this trade just before 12 o'clock and that was the before check out the after price uh really uh moved down pretty strong uh some time later and uh it worked out pretty good we actually closed out of this, this position for sixty dollars and uh net profit and uh walking away with about 45 dollars actually net profit on this position so this position pretty much worked out for a positive 300% return by 555, which is uh, still plenty of time before the uh, actual expiration. So I like this contract, these 7 a.m. contracts. I'm gonna keep my eye on them as I uh, look for these, look for similar positions throughout the night. And uh, it was pretty easy because I really just uh, set my take profit. So that worked out really, really well. Um, actually made up for a loss that I had um, let's let's uh, take a look at that so here around the same exact time uh, maybe about a half hour later 12 30 a.m. Eastern time I also was looking for another short trade on the euro yen same same uh, type of position the uh, difference was I actually thought this was gonna move faster uh, being that the uh, yen session had just passed um, I thought we may get some uh, sooner movement in it and uh, use the 3 a.m. contract. Moving forward, I'm going to, I'm taking notes to uh, just work with the 7 a.m. contracts. Uh, just gives us enough time to really uh, allow price to do what we may expect it to do. So with that being said, I'm going to move on with 7 a.m. contracts moving forward. Uh, in this position, particular position, we set up to take profit uh, 39 Got in at 87, was looking to get out at 39, uh, $13 dollar risk, which I like for a potential to make a, to walk away with $26 net profit. That's really what we're looking at by 3 a.m. on the trade. Um, that was really what we were looking at getting into the trade. I thought it was a fair risk to reward, um, just how I like it. And uh, we you know, just wanted to see how it worked out. So after the trade was on, as you can see here, it's about $13 risk, $14 risk, actually, uh, including fees. Uh, by the time of expiration, which was about this uh, candle up here, you can see that um, it wasn't until later where price actually started to push down. So if I got that 7 a.m. contract, similar to my Euro contract, you know, we would have been all good on this trade and then some. But, uh, you know, uh, it didn't work out that way. So, you know, just got to roll with the punches and uh, be smarter for next time. So this is at uh, 6, 17 a.m. You can see, uh, you know, when I got back for the update and, uh, yeah, closed out for, for a tiny loss, which is acceptable for me. Uh, you know, I've been experimenting with a couple different ways to trade these contracts, whether at the money or higher probabilities. Um, for me personally, in my trading style, um, I like to limit my risk. So these uh, smaller ones tiny risk uh, $13 risk with a bigger reward actually works works out a bit better for me personally in my personal trading and yeah so that was that that was this trade so um, 
previous trade, I think we got uh, 60 bucks and I lost 13 on this one. So it's still up for the day. And then uh, finally was a, a third trade here, uh, our hedge. I'm really liking taking, liking if that's a word. I think that's actually like a vampire or something in the movie. But anyways, um, getting back into the short, uh, got into a short position here on the Euro Yen as well, uh, additional one. But this is actually a hedge. And uh, the idea is to really put some insurance on our currency trade here. So as you can see, um, we got a contract that's highlighted here. Um, we also got the spreads in the background here. And as you can see, uh, prices at, at this particular time, which was uh, 2.14 a.m., uh, prices is at 38.55. So what I want to do is uh, I want to go short on the spot market, which I did there, and also get in long on the... Uh, Nadex uh, spreads uh, with a tight floor and when I mean tight floor I mean uh, pretty much like a stop loss on this buy order on Nadex and uh, if in this particular example the floor was a uh, 38.60 so uh, which was actually a bit higher than, uh, than the actual price um, so the way it played out uh, we, we got in at a floor of 38.60 actual price that we uh got in on this contract was 3876 uh, which is a bit up there and that's uh, just our insurance $16 insurance which I think is great for this trade you can see how it worked out uh, got our targets here on the spot market and uh, you know you just got to let it rip after that uh, another 7 a.m. contract which I'm you know happily taking note on um, that was the before and uh, as we get into the after As you can see, after, with the risk of uh, about 16 pips, we were able to, uh, the market, you know, push down as we, as we've seen in our previous example, because this was a 7 a.m. contract, it worked out a pretty better, actually a 7 a.m. spread, um, it worked out a bit better, uh, and actually, um, with a $16 risk, we were able to pull out about $80 out the market, which is great, you know, um, after, you know, calculate the actual cost of the trade on um, we are uh, walking away with a net profit of, excuse me seven two dollars it's a plus four hundred and fifty percent which is phenomenal by any by any means and uh, you know and this is at 5 30 so all before breakfast here in the United States which is great so I'm just gonna continue to uh, move forward with this research still in research mode right now and uh just getting accustomed to uh placing these trades at the same times and uh you know really just getting solid with my plan and uh you know still excited to just add nadex to the portfolio of you know growing trades so that being said i hope you found some value in this review um as you know it's your boy l camp at imxmanetrogrowth.com definitely welcome you to trade along subscribe and follow our post um Definitely open to your insight. And uh, till next time, happy trading. I am exponentialgrowth.com. So long.